Quenville now, right wing, will wind up and risk it, and a glove save by Charpentier. Big glove save there by Charpentier coming in from Quinville, coming to the middle. Um, they're unable, they're very unable to set up right now. Hampton Road is just doing an outstanding job. Here it is, the replay. Quinville coming over the blue line, takes the slapper and gets a nice wrist shot and a great glove save there. Charpentier has shown the glove is really maybe a favorite side. He is awfully hard to beat on the glove side. Yeah, we haven't beaten him there much so far, and definitely not start now. Bono leads the rush, holds it up now, centers it to Alexiev. His blast is good. Wow. Goal by Alexiev. Short-handed goal there by uh, Hampton Rhodes. Great play. Alex Alexiev. Coming out of the zone shorthanded. And I'm not sure if Goche was screened. He was indeed as, as uh, Dan Seaman was there in front of the net. And so Alexiev with the goal shorthanded. And it is a three to one Hampton Roads lead. It comes at the 151 mark here of the second period. The series to clean the cup four to two. And Gervais with another empty net. And this time he does not shoot it wide. Victor Gervais with the empty netter, and with 53 seconds to go, the Hampton Roads Admirals can now breathe whatever sigh of relief they feel they have to breathe. They have the three-goal lead, and now the Kelly Cup is simply a matter of time. There it is. Oh, dumped out of the play, Gervais right there. Now, stellar defense, great goaltending. It's tough to, the Pensacola got some offense generated, but nothing really, really great. They played a great game. The Admirals can celebrate the Kelly Cup, which they will take back to. And the Admirals are celebrating it now. A four to one win. The third cup for John Brophy. He has two Rileys and now a Kelly. And that is fitting for the Irishman behind the Admirals bench. They played an outstanding series all series long. Real confident bunch, but they played their game program right to a T. Congratulations. You saw Brophy accepting the congratulations of Al Peterson, and he will head off the ice. John Brophy will not go through the traditional lineup to shake hands. He says, the players didn't play me, they played the players. They don't need to shake my hands. Six, four to one. And the celebration in the Hampton Roads area, the Tidewater area, can begin. President of the league, Rick Adams, making his way out to the ice for the presentation of the Kelly Cup. Short did not play in this series due to injuries, and they are on the ice celebrating with their teammates. This team has overcome a lot this year, the Admirals, to get to this point. Both teams have, but the Admirals, really a remarkable story to get to this point, uh, losing a couple of key players uh, going into the final series. There is the Kelly Cup, the trophy they will take back to Hampton Roads in one of the great traditions in sport as the two teams line up on the ice, one to console, one to congratulate. Let's go to Doug Mouton with Sebastian Charpentier. First, Charpentier, after all the superlatives, he says, yeah, he'll be somewhere else next year. He's uh, well on his way, brilliant career for that young man, and a terrific team in front of him as well. We will be back in a few minutes, but the Hampton Roads Admirals have won the Kelly Cup.